Hello to all my friends out there. So I want to make some cornbread with my egg replacer to show you guys how easy it is. Okay, when after I eat all these little packages of cornbread, I'm going to start making them from scratch. Okay, so for this, I need um, one egg. So you need uh, two tablespoons water. Here, let me show you. This is how easy this is, right here. You need one and a half teaspoons of egg replacer and two tablespoons warm water. That equals one egg. So we'll do this first. Okay, so I bought this at Walmart and it, it contains uh, 113 eggs. So this is a good thing. I just keep it in the refrigerator and it lasts forever. Um, I wrap it up so it doesn't get stale. I had it in a um, in a plastic bag. So okay, one and a half. And this is a good thing, you know, as soon as you can afford it. So okay, this is the egg replacer. I'm gonna be baking some stuff out of this, and then uh, two tablespoons water. Warm water. I'm going to be back too in a minute with some um, granola. I'm going to make some granola. Okay, so you just, you know, stir it around. I I've had nothing but good luck with this stuff. It's never, it's never failed me in any way, shape, or form. Okay, so that is equal to one egg. And then I need, uh, let's see, uh, one half cup milk. So, okay, I'll just pour that in. And then one half, I have uh, powdered milk. I'll be buying powdered milk uh, and a few more stockpile items this week. Um, you know, I was watching, um, I don't know what you want to call them, whistleblowers. I sometimes refer to them as alarmists and uh, they seem kind of genuinely alarmed. <laughs> I'm going to post a couple of them. Uh, I mean, I'm not trying to call them alarmists because, uh, you know, usually um, I'm sure like in every circumstances, every bad circumstance, warnings were given and were not heeded. So I'm going to post some of these um, videos on my Twitter. Just go to Rota Stone Twitter. I'm going to, as soon as I make this. Okay, so the thing about uh, corn muffins is you don't want to, you know, over stir. My stuff is kind of lumpy. So, okay, so these are going to turn out fine using this egg replacer. I think this is about uh, four, four or five dollars. Uh, I want to start using that, you know, when I'm baking like cornbread and it doesn't make one single bit of difference, I will use my egg replacer. I assume it would have the properties of eggs. I don't know, as long as it works. You want to stockpile stuff that you might possibly... Have you ever gone to make a, a cake or something and run out of eggs and, and oh no, or cookies? So, okay. Walmart, I will be back with some granola.